Jupiter, the gas giant, has always fascinated scientists and space enthusiasts alike. Its sheer scale and extreme environment make it an intriguing topic to explore. But what if I were to take the plunge and venture onto the planet's surface? Could I really survive on Jupiter? Let's start with the most obvious hurdle. Jupiter has no solid surface. It's a gas giant, meaning it's primarily composed of hydrogen and helium. The pressure and temperature conditions on Jupiter are so extreme that they create an environment where liquids and solids can't exist. Imagine trying to stand on a surface that's more like a thick, swirly fog than solid ground. The lack of a solid surface makes it impossible to establish a foothold, let alone build any kind of infrastructure. Another challenge is the intense storm systems that dominate Jupiter's atmosphere. The Great Red Spot, a persistent anticyclonic storm, has been raging for centuries. The winds and storm patterns on Jupiter are so powerful that they could swallow several Earths whole. The turbulence and chaos would make it impossible to navigate, let alone find shelter. The planet's air is mostly hydrogen and helium, with trace amounts of methane and ammonia. These gases would be lethal to humans in a matter of minutes. The atmosphere is also home to extreme radiation levels, which would be catastrophic to both human health and electronic equipment. The planet's magnetic field is so strong that it would interfere with communication equipment and pose a significant risk to both humans and technology. The gravity on Jupiter is so strong that it would crush any spacecraft or structure that tried to land on the planet. The radiation levels are also so high that they would damage or destroy any electronic equipment. The radiation would be lethal to humans and would require specialized shielding to protect both people and equipment. The planet's core is so hot that it radiates heat into the atmosphere, creating convection currents that drive the storm systems. The temperature differences between the upper and lower atmosphere are so extreme that they create powerful jet streams that shape the planet's weather patterns. The planet's atmosphere is so massive that it creates its own internal heat, which in turn drives the weather patterns. One critical aspect that highlights the impossibility of surviving on Jupiter is the acceleration required to reach its gravitational escape velocity. It would require an enormous amount of fuel far beyond what's currently possible with our technology. This means that even if we could somehow manage to survive the harsh environment, we'd never be able to leave the planet. The impossibility of survival on Jupiter is further compounded by the lack of resources available on the planet. In conclusion, surviving on Jupiter is an impossibility.